Hey everybody, J Super Awesome here. I'd like to welcome you all back to another update video. I have some DVDs to show and I only have three Blu-rays for this update, but I do have quite a few DVDs to get through, so I wanted to go ahead and put out a video before it got way too far out of hand. So let's go ahead and get into it. I'll show the Blu-rays I have first. Up first is Grandmother's House. And I had a pre-order on this one. I'm going to show the alternate cover art for this one. This is what I remember in the video store when I was a kid. So that that's that one. That's by Vinegar Syndrome. And then, of course, I already have a review up for The Brain. But it's a new Scream Factory release. It's a really cool movie. And, of course, Superstition already have a review up for this one as well so if you guys are on this video and have not seen these reviews and you're interested in these movies just check them out okay so that was it for the blu-rays not very much to show there so i'm gonna get on to the dvds up first is blood lake i had a pre-order on this one soon as i found out about its announcement i went ahead and pre-ordered it haven't seen it yet but it's definitely right up my alley so happy to get that one next one is red island this was a walmart pickup and i have actually already watched this one and it says awaken the evil at the bottom of it and after i woke up from trying to watch that movie evil had awoken next up is megalodon this is the new one with michael madison have not watched this one yet. Next up is a Screen Factory release for Elizabeth Harvest. The next one is The Manor. Big Sexy Kevin Nash. Next up is Mom and Dad with Nicolas Cage. Selma Blair. The next one is Raw. I've actually heard some pretty good things about this one. Next up is American Mary. Children of the Corn, The Runaway. I don't know why this movie right here stayed so expensive for. Next one is Grave Digger, and this one is not about a monster truck. Next up is Scarecrowd. Looks like an extremely cheesy scarecrow film. The Ghost Galleon. Now, I don't have any of the Blind Dead movies except for this one, so I'm way behind on these so i'm going to have to collect them individually next one is the janitor black demons this is a shriek show release next one is sorority babes and the slime ball bolorama i haven't seen this movie in forever I got this super cheap. Next up is The Chilling. Now this movie is from 1989 and it has Linda Blair in it. If you guys know anything about this one at all, let me know. I thought it looked pretty cool. Next one is Saint Nick. I've seen Midnight Releasing. Vampire in Brooklyn. That's a uh, Wes Craven and Eddie Murphy duo. I remember when this came out, I thought it was very odd for Eddie Murphy to be a vampire. But he was in that movie. Next one is President's Day. Terror of Frankenstein. When I run across Frankenstein films that I do not own, I almost always pick them up. 
Next up is Ghoul School. Count motion pictures. The next few are going to be some trauma releases. Now my trauma collection is kind of pitiful, so I wanted to kind of up my movies um, for the trauma collection. Up first is Terror Firmer. This is a two disc set. I watched the trailer for that one and it looked crazy. Next up is Combat Shock. Now my wife actually picked me some of these up so that was very cool of her. Period Piece. Trailer Town. Meat Weed Madness. I don't even know what to say about that. And of course, Redneck Zombies. Suicide. Okay, so next up are going to be some foreign release titles. I think mostly Japanese or maybe Korean titles. First up is MPD Multiple Personality Detective. Shadow of Wrath. Or Wraith, maybe. Next up is Dead Waves. I get to land these down and it's hard to read them upside down. The Dimension Travelers. Crazy Lips. And last up for this update is Cursed Death and Spirit. So there you have it. That's my update. These are all my most recent pickups. I hope you guys enjoyed watching these videos. And uh, please like, subscribe, and comment below. And let me know what you think about some of these. I'd like to thank you for watching.